Hey everyone, welcome to the channel and uh, thank you so much for watching. So I've been documenting my journey in the whole process of the semi-finals all the way to the World Championship of Public Speaking. And for those who don't know what is this, basically every year Toastmasters will host an international worldwide competition and they call it the International Speech Contest which leads up to the World Championship of Public Speaking. So some of you may start your competition as early as December or some of you may be in January and you progress through many levels before reaching the finals. So that's the club, the area, the division, district, region quarterfinals, semi-finals and finally the World Championship of Public Speaking. So there's about seven rounds. So in the past video, I've actually talked about how I was rehearsing and practicing and I'm so thankful and so grateful for this opportunity provided by Toastmasters and well, the surprising thing is I managed to win this! Alright, our third place winner! Mas Mahathir bin Mohammed. That's right. So this is actually the third place trophy for the World Championship of Public Speaking. Every year there's about 30,000 people competing from over I think 120 countries and that's a really really uh, amazing thing that Toastmaster has done to inspire so many people to join this competition. So I'm so blessed and I thank God that I'm able to win the third placing in this World Championship of Public Speaking in 2022. But of course, this whole journey, there's a lot of stress, there's a lot of ups and downs where you're just wondering like, ah, oh, is my speech good enough? Am I good enough? Or, you know, how can I make it better? And there's so many of these things and it becomes so overwhelming when you receive so many feedback from different people. So as you progress through this journey in this competition, uh, one thing is for sure is ask yourself whether the message that you want to share is it something that matters to you and something that you feel so passionate about because if you feel passionate about this and you share that message people will feel and they will be inspired by your message so that's one of the most important things in this contest it's never so much about winning winning should always be secondary changing lives should always be your priority and it should be the primary goal so right now the journey and the season has ended and i really look forward to trying it again and to see how far i'll be able to inspire more people this year one of my main goals was just to enter the finals that's it just to enter and i was so thrilled when i was able to enter and during the finals I was surprisingly more calm during the finals compared to the semi-finals because in the finals, my mentality was I'm just going to go have fun, I'm just going to deliver the speech in the most me way possible. So I don't really care about whether I'm placed or not. So when I delivered the speech, I felt so good because that's me, right? And I felt that I delivered it the best that I could. So it has been an amazing journey. And if you're thinking of competing the next year, good luck, go for it, and just try your best. And ultimately, winning should not be a priority as mentioned before. It should always be about growth and changing lives. So that's it. Thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you changing more lives in the future.